is it that is making us not to see in the spirit? Or to hear from God. We are not constant in our journey. We are fluctuating in our journey. Scripturally, we are Christians. We are Christians. Who are supposed to be grounded. But when the wind blows, we are shaken. Our faith goes down. We are still visible outside. But inside we are affected. When challenges come your way. When challenges come your way. They are questioning you. Are you, are you what you said you are? Let me give an example by one person. Let me call that man. Let me call that man. Let's call other two. Yeah, come. Let's call this one. Come this one. This one. Can you see this one? Call this man a financial problem. Your money. This one is sickness. Can you see that? Look at this one. Can you just go aside? Stand like that. When this man is free like this, this man can worship God. This man can be happy and say, God is happy. But what is it that is affecting us? If this small problem come here, this man will be forced to pray concerning this. Forgetting who brought this. The one who brings this is what? Is Satan. Is Satan. He bring this one to stop this man. I don't know if you hear me. Look here. If this man can overcome this one and come behind here, when he reaches, it is not over. That one can come. This one is sickness now. Demanding what you have overcome. Can I tell you this? Once you have money, sickness will come. Because there's nothing that you have to be tested of. So the sickness must come to challenge you. Otherwise you will worship God better. So overcome sickness, the way you have overcome money, you are constant. You are being checked. But if you fail to overcome disease, the same way you overcome, the same disease will come in another fashion. I don't know if you are hearing me. So the test you are going through are there for the light you are having in you. But if you overcome this and always come here, now you begin to know what will happen. You begin to know why it happened. I don't know if you are hearing me. Okay, God bless you. God bless you. I, I'm trying to Explain. I don't know how I can explain this. I don't know how uh, I can explain this, uh, but but maybe if I explain it in this way, maybe it will help you. Let me tell you what it is. Maybe it will help you. Maybe it will help you. Maybe let's bring Mama. Mama. Come, come with the Bible. Come with the Bible. Come. Come again. Come. Let's bring Mama here. And let's come here. Can you just come? Don't come with anything. Go and stand there, sir. 
Can you see these people? This one is the word of God. That one is empty. Can you see that? Levan. So when you are moving, can you just move together? One step. Go back together. Can you see that? Put the word of God. Just do it like with one hand on her head. Okay, on her head. head. Yeah, like that. Can you see that? Eh? Amen. So move like that. Move like that. Move like that. Stop there. Amen. So, what affect these people here? This one, let's call him an angel of God. This one, let's call him an angel of of Jemistain. <laughs> if we say of Satan, <laughs> hey, her husband is here. Okay. All right. Can you see these people down? This one is, you understand? Look here. This one ba. is responsible to make the word of God to stay here. But this one, Marao, when they are moving, won't stop. Will go and bring things to stop this one so that the word of God will come out. I don't know if you're hearing me. Now when you move, Start, you move forward. Eh? You, you move forward. Come here. Stop. Come, come. Face it. Do your hands like this. Because you're, you're from Jemistel. Okay, okay. Look here. Put the hand of God there. So you face this one. Can you see that? Now you walk with the hand. You face this one. Now you walk Can you see that? Uh, no, you walk facing there. Looking at this one. Uh -huh. Can you see this one? This is what is happening. Go back. Go back. Go back. When you move, just like that. Can you see that? Your hands. Jimmy Stein. Jimmy Stein. Carry on, Jimmy Stein. Jimmy Stein. Jimmy Stein. This is what is happening in the spirit. Can you do it? I don't know how I can explain that to you. Now. The moment when you take your eyes and look at the angel of Jemistin, the word of God will be lifted. It's a system. Like it's not what you decide. It's a system. It's a system that has been established. If, okay, let's give an example by Daniel. Daniel. When Daniel said, I don't want to eat this kind of food. He entered inside a system. That makes God to say, oh, this man mm -hmm. must be given this. This is not something that you are born with. It's not like Old Testament. This is coming from your work with God. I don't know if you hear me. So make sure that your road, your train, is clear. Allow the light of God to lighten you so that whatever that can grow up to stop you will die on the road or you escape it moving towards your destiny. God bless you. Okay.